not do. Clear, we gotta go to the track, brother. Brother, I just sat down. I haven't even eaten lunch. Well, you got two minutes. You better figure something out. It's a good thing today's video is sponsored by Factor because I got a two minute meal right here. Let me just grab one of my quick and easy Factor meals, dude. This thing can be ready in two minutes. Artichoke and spinach chicken, that'll work. Slide this off, poke some vents, pop her in the microwave for two minutes. Ooh, 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 fire me up, dude. Guys, head to factor75.com or click the link in my description and use code Cletus50 at checkout to get 50% off your first Factor box. These meals are fresh, never frozen. Factor has over 35 plus weekly meals that you can choose from, prepared to perfection by chefs and ready to eat in record time. Factor makes it effortless when you're in a rush and keep your energy up with their lunch to go. Factor has effortless wholesome meals like grain bowls and salad toppers that don't even require a microwave to heat them up. Let's get a little bite of this chicken right here, dude. Cooked perfectly, it's actually really good. This has got to be one of my favorite sponsors of all time. They got great vegetables, and if you're a vegetarian, they have options for you too. One nice thing about Factor is they also have protein plus meals with 30 grams of protein or more per serving. They've also got keto or calorie smart meals with around less than 550 calories per serving. There's literally an option for everyone. And like I said right now, guys, if you go to factor75.com or use the link in the description, and use code Cletus50 at checkout. You can get 50% off your Factor meal boxes. A huge thanks to Factor for sponsoring today's video. Let's get to the live action. Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Cletus McFarlane YouTube channel. All right, guys, we're officially nine days away from the Black Rifle Coffee Company 2.4 hours of lay mullets at the Freedom Factory. But here's the deal. We had some driver changes. We now have BJ Baldwin racing. We now have Haley Deegan racing. I'll tell you this. We have sold more tickets for this year's 2.4 hours of lay mullets. We're still nine days away than we did last year in total for the whole thing all said and done. So we're starting to get low on tickets and I really want to sell it out. So if you guys want to come out to the 2.4 hours of lay mullets, November 17th, Grab your tickets now on thefoat.com slash freedom factory. We also added on a free drag racing show on Saturday after the burnout. So if you're coming to Lay Mullets Friday night, you gotta come to Cleese and Car Saturday because then you gotta come to our free drag racing show afterwards. It's gonna be the most insane weekend you can ever imagine for the ticket prices that we have. I mean, it's more value than you can imagine. I don't know any other venue that has this much value. As enough yapping, let's get back to the video. Brother! Land that thing right here. Land it. All right, guys, we are out here in the good old glamorous dunes. We got a side by side blog out here, set up a trip. It's been two years since we've been out in the dunes. And uh, you see on the trailer back here, we got our machines from Florida, but we got a bonus unit, okay? Bonus. Bonus unit, show them what we got. Shoo! Sand rail. Everyone's been saying, you got, oh. Look at this tire, dude. <laughs> All right, everyone's been saying for years that I need to get into a sand rail. Here's the deal. No one will lend you a sand rail. It's really hard. I put posts out on the internet that says, someone lend me a sand rail. I'll pay you to rent it for the weekend. Turns out they're super easy to crash. So what we went ahead and did was bought one, okay? I have no need to own this at all, but this is the only chance I could get to actually run a good sand car. This is the first time I've actually seen it in my life because I bought it sight unseen from a guy in Colorado. Our transport guy picked it up on the way and we are now laying eyes on it for the first time. Jace wrote his freaking initials on the Whipple supercharger that this thing's got. That's a big selling point for me. So it's got a built LS with a Whipple. I mean, hard I, to say no. Can you guys think of anything that could go wrong? Yeah. No. No. George will be in it. You have spare belts. Yeah, I got a spare belt. All right, bud. Here's the deal. I already told everyone here, if they see me and I'm not doing a wheelie, they can punch me in the face because my <laughs> my entire weekend will be me popping a wheelie on everyone who can't pop wheelies in, in the dunes. So, hey, Leo, can you pop wheelies or how's that? Uh, yeah, maybe. Yeah. Maybe a little bit. That's a sucker, no. dude, certified wheelie popper. So before I bought it from the guy, I said, can't do a wheelie. He sent me a video of it doing a wheelie. I said, done deal. We'll be on our way to pick it up. So right now we're gonna put some tires on it. We got the paddles on transport set. Then we're gonna roll it off the trailer, 
and go do a wheelie. Dude, can we fire it up first? I mean, we can fire it up. Let's fire it up. Let's see if we can find this. You got the keys or something? So here's what we got. This is a 2009 Extreme Double Throwdown 2 is the model. <laughs> I mean, name. come on, dude, listen to the model. It's got a LS3 416 stroker engine, Whipple 2.9 liter supercharger, it's running the 85, it's got a sequential Mendiola S4 four-speed sequential transmission. It's got some sweet seats, car to car intercom, Fox Bypass 2.0 and 2.5 inch shocks on the back and uh, enough fuel system to make it all work, so. <laughs> enough said, dude. Yeah, enough that said. So all right, I think look at the axles on that unit. Dude, oh, they're solid. Did you see the exhaust, George? Yeah, look at the exhaust. Exhaust? It's just straight header nice to this shit. collector oh. back here. <laughs> It really is. Center cut, dude. <laughs> oh, oh man. A lot of intake. I'm ready. I'm standing back here for this. Uh oh. We got fuel. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god. Side vlog. I know you want to buy this already. That thing sounds good. Our meat. That. That's a big rigs. What a lug pattern. Power <laughs> top. That's Man, a unit, dude. Better. We're about to do a wheelie in the pits. <laughs> yeah, if you don't do a wheelie, leave in the pits here. I think I get to punch you in the face. Right? <laughs> Did you say that? Yeah. I mean, we're not now. here to the RV. He's doing a wheelie. Yeah. yeah. How <laughs> sensitive are these transmissions? Because I hear they are sensitive. Mendiola, dude, you'll be fine. Those things never break. We're gonna try and not blow the transmission apart. They're notoriously sensitive. Oh, the meat! Ten times oh cooler. yeah. The powder coat is clean. I know. It's, it's like bad. candy apple red, dude. Oh boy. <laughs> I don't want to ruin it. Dude. No, Just how you gonna ruin it? I have no choice. How nice it looks right now. Can we get some before and after from this weekend? Dude, it's gonna be fine. It'll just be handy to have that motor for the burnout truck. Golly, it looks so much cooler on that tire. I wanna make this the official call out. Hellforce versus Sandrail right now. Lock it in. Oh, Lock you're done. In, you freaking nerd, dude. Get <laughs> out of here, dude. I think, oh, that's the dude. <laughs> Screw it back in. I'm so fired up right now, dude. I know, this is exciting. I'm feeling crazy. I can't wait to do a wheelie. Yeah, I wonder if we need to check the tune on it at all. Nah, you guys don't worry about that belt. All right, I got the belt under control. We better... You don't worry we about have that, noticed, bud. Is the sand car life better than the side-by-side -side life? We're gonna find out this weekend on the Cleaves from Tron channel. Oh. You ready? I think it's better. Oh yeah, dude. Oh yeah, she's ready. She is dialed. What are you doing, dude? 
Leave, what are you doing? It's Nothing. lean, I can just feel it. All right, got the laptop out, just tuning in this new buggy. Guys, we've got Chad from the Shop Inc. Team viewing in right now to fix the sand rail because I totally blew the tune apart. <laughs> so he's in here pressing buttons. Things are looking good. MS3 Pro, I, he knows what he's doing. All right, well, Chad got a tune up. Already sounds better. Camming out. Feeling good, brother. Feeling good. She sounds good. He's got the filter All right, well, we're pulling the filter apart because we got a clog or something like that. Oh, oh that explains it. Okay, so the it's filters collapsed. collapsed. Pull it out. Brother, that's the pre-filter? Smoked. Post-filter was collapsed, too. Oh, dude. What you got? We got some chunks in here. Is that the pre or the post? This is the pre. Oh, so when they fabbed the... Yeah, tank. The tank. All right, we're on to something, people. All right, guys, we're uh, four hours into sand car ownership, and <laughs> this <Already>? sucks, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I've... I'm missing my side-by-side -side right now that just always runs perfect. Dude, I know, don't even talk it's about It's gonna pay it. off though. Guys, big shout out to our boy Harvey at Glamis Fab. Just opened oh, up and got geez. us filters. Unbelievable. All right, fire it up. I'm holding the laptop. Cleaner's on the phone with the tuner. Chad's on the laptop, you're not on the laptop. No, I'm holding it. <laughs> Chad's tuning it, Cleats driving. Basically a street tune slash dune tune right now. All right, we're just gonna do a short, like, second gear pull. Sounds so much better already, dude. Oh my god! 
gosh, that thing is loud. Dude, she looks mean. an amazing night amazing just had an amazing night did so many wheelies in one night almost flipped over forward over again <laughs> but the wheelbase is so long we're good and now we parked a little far from our barrel but we're able to shoot the shot you and got it dude feeling right on this thing man. everything's going good for a daytime rip because you know we didn't get the car figured out till nighttime so you know that daytime rip is going to be spicy spicy we'll see you guys in the morning keep going baby <laughs> Somehow George has gotten into hell for us. What are you doing? Uber. Oh. Oh. Hey, Garza. This is a, this is a 450, brother. Get on it, dude. Flames oh, out. Shit, dude. <laughs> Garza oh, on the 450 yeah. right now. Yeah. <laughs> that guy's gone. gone. That made me the last time I've ever seen Garza. He's back up! Oh! Oh! Dude, he literally just flew. I don't think she even saw that. Oh, Cleet jumped on the back. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright guys, last night we had so much fun with the sand rail, but we couldn't really get any good videos, so we didn't hurt it or anything. Everything's still running perfect. Did a lot of fat wheelies. Just enjoyed the hell out of it. So we're pumping some E85 in it right now. We're gonna go have a hell of a rip today. Alright guys, these are the guys who saved us last night. What are the odds they had a fuel filter? I mean a pretty rare one to be honest and got her back up and going. So they work on all kinds of cars up here and uh saved our butts. Appreciate you, brother. No problem, man. Anytime. So we're realizing we got uh no travel going on. So Barbie's gonna set us up, make sure we got nitrogen in our shocks and all that. It's been sitting for a while. Yeah, get her adjusted up and get her riding good. And this is actually who I contacted before I bought this because I was like, is this car decent? I mean, you probably know more about it. It's called a double throwdown. Yeah, it's an extreme double throwdown. And it's actually the second version of it. It's kind of one of the best cars they ever made. So, uh, got my passes like all the way around. Yeah, it's a good car. <laughs> Definitely I a good mean, car. with a name like that. Yeah, once you signed off on it, I was like, all right, we'll buy it. Yeah. With the transmissions, uh, are they fragile or are we going to No, this right? has got a sequential and it's a Mindiola S4. It's pretty strong. It'll hold the power. Um, your, no. clutch, your clutch foot, eh. But, <laughs> you know, I, I think it'll be okay. It's a 934 CV car, so you're not going to break yeah. those. Can we put uh, both wings on those? No, not on the outers. You want those boots to move. Really? Even yes. the inner too? Yep. Oh, okay. Well, you always want those to flex. These are all things. I would have been like, that needs a hose, man. <laughs> okay. Some nitrogen, dude? Yeah. yeah. Is it empty? Yeah, the, the other side was empty. So what happens is there's a piston inside here. There's oil on this side and gas on this side. And when there's no gas in here, when the car hits the bumps, that piston just slaps around inside there. Mm. So Hopefully there's no, no control. So we're going to go ahead and put 175 pounds in here. Yeah, and quietly, you can empty. hear it. Dead empty. You can actually hear the suspension pushing. We're getting upgrades out here, boy. This thing's going to be a whole new car. Yeah. yeah, you can hear it. Yeah, you can hear it. Learning as we go. <laughs> We're so lucky these guys. Oh, are here. yeah. We would have just rode it like that. All hey, like it's not about what you know, it's about who you know. <laughs> CH53 rolling, brother. 50,000 pounds of freedom beating up the air right there. All right, guys, we, have the, we are at 
I don't know, we're in the middle of some sand and uh, we're ripping, dude. This thing just goes through the dunes, amazing. On our way to this place called China Wall. It's a pretty cool spot. Well, after our quick pit stop, we got stuck. I goofed, you know, I parked with the nose uphill. Now we're digging, but you know, it could be worse. Luckily it's four seater, so we got extra bodies. <laughs> <laughs> we're a two seater, we'd be screwed. Well, I'd never get towed out by the sea boy. But here we are, dude. Here comes Cleeter. Let's go. <laughs> we got Cletus and Hellforce coming up. Dude. I want to see some ripping. We finally found a good open area where I can just kind of screw around because everything else we're like riding somewhere. This is the first time we've had a big open area. Just gonna do a couple practice wheelies. Maybe try a little drift 180 thing, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, just, I'll just stay right just here. You do out. something cool. Yeah. If, if I'm doing a wheelie at you, get out of the way. You know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, this is a good spot. There's no traffic.
That thing was straight up in the air. Oh, I hit a jump. That thing is making some power. Basically, if Leroy Jr. was a doom buggy. Oh! <laughs> Dude! That was clean! <laughs> oh. Brother! Broken. Broke your belt, you nerd! That's my belt? <laughs> Well, we got a spare. Oh, okay, because I thought I broke the power steering and landed with the wheel <laughs> turning a little bit. First yeah. breakdown, dude. First break, but we do have a belt. Oh, uh, we don't have but any we should have, We should have brought the stuff to be able to change the belt. Yeah, she's dangling right there. Yeah, that's... Well. All right. Ah! Ah. So we just need a, we need a uh, ratchet. Or a pry bar. Yeah. All right, new belt on. Thanks to Wayne and his wife, who I met this morning. We weren't broken down for four seconds, and they showed up. No, like, they had just enough tools to make this happen. We have zero, obviously. <laughs> you know I mean? But we made it work with uh, one of those <laughs> and that pry bar. And that got. pry bar. And those muscles. There we go. That's all right. Thank Thanks you guys. Us. Well, we finally made it to the drag strip. Dude, there's a lot of people out here. We're going to find the entrance so I can race. I don't even know where it's at. Oh, here it is. Dude, look at that thing. Golly. Let's see a rim. Oh, we're calling out the big dog right here. <laughs> beat us so bad they had to shut down the drag strip. So <laughs> now we're gonna go back, put the smaller pulley on, come back tomorrow. <laughs> oh! Yeah, there's another one on the other side. Look at the transmission, it's all billet. Golly! That what thing is rowdy. A buckshot. Oh, oh buckshot. Buckshot. We're running it back!
running good, dude? Yeah, I think the fuel filters might be clogging again. Yeah. I'm getting like inconsistent. Like it makes a good clean pull and then it kind of feels down on power and breaks up a little bit. So I'm like, oh, we should probably be done drag racing it for the night. We have those spare fuel filters, so we might as well slap them in. There's probably still some residual crap in the tank. Yeah. We should plug them up today. But overall, she's performed fantastic. She's, oh, she's doing, doing I mean, great. She's we're out here getting W's, doing wheelies. Pretty much everything we wanted to do. We just had to work through some bugs. So. But we're going to the big hill tonight, so maybe we'll go do those filters after dinner and go rip it. That's the plan. Look at this, man. This is Cam Fraser. People have no idea that JH is a chef. He just whipped this up. We got Easton keeping it warm. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just watching it. Yeah. yeah I just let all kind of slip some stuff for a minute, you know? <laughs> hey, dude, thanks for cooking for us, bro. This looks amazing. You get no credit. He keeps me healthy. Yeah, it's a healthy I, meal. Hey, hey, bro. Homemade. You did make a salad. It's Homemade pretty good. salad. I'll give you that. It's pretty good. How are you feeling, George? What do you think about this sand car life, dude? Dude, I'm. All right, I'm going to tell you right now, way better than a side by side i'm yeah. getting old you know so this is more my style that's been a shocking thing for me because i am a diehard side by side guy you guys have seen me rip side by sides forever and uh to be honest this is a 2009 i have the best of the best newest side by side stuff this is a 2009 sand car and i definitely like doing in it better than my side by side <laughs> i don't even know specifically why but the wheelbase the instant 700 horsepower available and just everything about it it rides like a cloud it's just a lot better you know the side by sides are amazing but this thing just is a level above and think about the fact that it's 15 years old wow. so man I, I just am super impressed i can't imagine how good a 2023 sand rail is like from <laughs> one of these modern companies that's just making them insane like the buckshot we race i'm super stoked on how this car has turned out facebook marketplace bought it three days ago and we just had an absolute blast we've got big plans for it today but we're gonna end off the first video from our trip out here to glamis right now you guys have to come back see more action with the sand rail but that's it for now thanks for watching do it for dale we'll freaking see you later